speed. I never thought we would raise this much money. This will be enough money to pay for Duke's medical and legal bills. Yeah, well, he could use some good news now, probably. This also proves that we made the right decision about reopening Duke's club. It's also going to be nice having a little extra change in our pockets, huh? I think this was the best decision we ever made. Sweetheart, getting married was the best decision we ever made. <laughs> Should I uh, come back later? Oh, hey, Will. No, no. Come on in. Come on in. Hi, Will. Hey, Morning, Felicia. Yeah. See ya. Uh, looks like you did pretty well on your opening night. Oh, yeah, I just do this detective stuff on the side as a hobby. Hey, nice threads here. Well, the suit, yeah, it's my uh, uniform for this prostitution case I've been working on. Well, I don't think anybody would hire you looking like that. Uh, Felicia, I'm posing as John, not as a prostitute. I'm here to pick up your husband. We're working on the same case. Uh, listen, Will, I'll tell you what. I I why don't you just take off without me? I, I don't have any clothes that can work out on this case right now anyway, OK? <sighs> I don't think I like you working on that kind of case. Well, I'll have to tell the chief to run her assignments by your wife before she goes through the trouble of uh, assigning them to you. Uh, you know what I mean. Anyway, uh, I have a little police business I have to take care of first. That's right. We have to let Duke know how much money we made for him opening night. Well, first things first. That's right. Plus, we have to talk to Jake Meyer about their testimony for Duke's trial. Well, it sounds like you're going to be pretty busy. That's right, partner. Just following Chief Devane's orders. You shouldn't have done this. It's too much money. Hey, we didn't do anything but collect the cash. All your friends gathered that money together. The Dock Workers Union, they support you. I don't deserve it. Well, we see it differently. The city owes you a lot. Could I ask you to do me one more favor? Doesn't this guy ever give up? <laughs> what? Would you, uh, would you use some of this money and, and buy Christmas presents for Anna and Robin and for Robert? Um, well, that's, that's a nice idea, but we raised that money for your legal and your medical bills. I know that. Well, are you sure you're gonna have enough to pay your bills if we buy a few presents? It's important to me. Well, then we'll do it. Well, thank you. I want to, uh, I want to give you these also. What are these for? They're the keys for the elevator and the penthouse above the club. Do you want us to pick up something? No, I want you to, to use the place. Well, we can't do that. That's your home. Well, whichever way you look at it, I'm certainly not going to be there for quite a while. And since you guys are now running the, the club, I, well, you might as well have some of the perks that go along with the job. <laughs> well, that's some perk. Thank you. Listen, this is very really generous, and, well, we'll, we'll do this. As long as the arrangement is temporary until you're up and around. <clears throat> Out of jail and around, you mean? <sighs> Time for your therapy session, Mr. Lavery. All right, Georgia. I'm ready. Here you go. Well, don't you worry about those Christmas presents. We'll take care of them. You bet. Right? Okay. Thank you. Hey. Thanks. For everything. Now I'm the one who should be thanking you. Thank you. We'll see you soon. Working too hard now. I believe this is happening. Wow. Whew. Be it ever so humble. <laughs> oh, Frisco, look at the view. Oh, wow. See the whole harbor. Yeah. Mm. And you know, we won't have to do any cooking over Christmas either, because if we get hungry, all we have to do is just call the kitchen and they'll send something up anytime we want. That leaves us more time to satisfy our other hungers. Well, any way you look at it, it beats a tuna casserole. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm supposed to be working. No, well, not now you don't. Hmm. Duty calls. Yeah, Will. What's up? Well, of course this is police business. Well, you can come up if you want. Yeah, I'll send the elevator down. So much for romance, huh? Well, honey. 
there will be plenty of time for romance. I promise. You can't keep up with me anyway. <laughs> you, uh, you call this police business? I should hey. be so lucky to get an assignment like this. I was just killing a little time till you got here. Ah, nice digs. Yes, we like it. Well, let me make a suggestion, pal. We better stop by headquarters pretty soon, or you may find yourself singing here full time. I, I want to get a hold of Jake first. I'm just going to stick around and get acquainted with our new place. Okay, well, I'll meet you in the elevator. Have fun, okay? Thank <laughs> you.